Hi everybody. So today I was asked a lot to go through the cards of positive, negative, neutral. I'm opening a new deck. I don't have to open my one. So let's go through them. So the first card we have is the rider. The rider is a neutral card because um, it talks about messages, it talks about news, it talks about... So whatever cards around it tells you if it's positive or negative. Um, so that is a neutral card. Next, we have the Clover. This is a positive card. This, when it comes in a reading, it kind of gives a... This kind of feeling. I can't explain. It just gives a, you know... So even if there's negative cards around it, you know, always look for, you know, some silver lining going on there because um, this is a, you know, kind of a happy-go-lucky kind of a card. So it's a positive card. Next, we have the ship. The ship is a neutral card because it talks about movement and it's action. So for action, um, is is depends on what... Is around it you know movement what kind of movement is a good movement is a bad movement you have to see what's around it next we have the house neutral another neutral same thing the house talks about family it talks about the people around you um so neutral dun, dun, dun. neutral neutral it's not negative it's not positive um it depends on the cards around it so is around this can tell us what type of problem what, what's going on uh, good health bad health all that kind of stuff um this is how i use it very negative for me this is very 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 negative this is very negative because when you're in the clouds you say things you make the stake decisions if you do them under the clouds there's repercussion and you have to pay for like there's even when the clouds are gone people are still like upset about what you said or you know whatever decision you made you know so negative card negative card This is a snake card, guys. This is a snake. It's a snake. It's a snake. It's negative. Um, it is always negative, it, except to 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 in to context. This can be not negative. Is when you are asking what type of what's in the box or what did he get? What did he get me for my birthday? You know, and if you get the snake, you know, it could be uh, a chain or, 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 or a bracelet. Um, the other context would be, um, how does she look like? So this would be sexy. Um, any other reading? This is a negative card. The snake's gonna bite you. The snake will bite you. The snake is going to bite you. The snake bites. You're doing daily um all the negative and positive kind of gets dimmed so this could be just trouble it could be um you know uh, you have to be like stuck behind uh, a car accident and you know and all that kind of stuff or um you getting hurt by tripping over something or just you know having a cold um Otherwise, is betrayal, is lies. This is snake. All right, next, the coffin. It's a negative card. It's one of the big negative cards for me. Um, the, the coffin talks about ending, talks about mm, depression, talks about somebody being so negative and, 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 you know, those people that are like gloomy and, and you're like, oh, you know, that you feel like you're being drained. Just a very negative card. A card that talks about endings and um, talks about things not going anywhere. 
it talks about heavy sadness um, this is the card of you know mourning I mean and, and this this is a heavy heavy card and and it's negative and you know it closes things and everything so kind of you know oof, you know again for daily it could be just a headache so daily remember for daily always bring it down next one we have da -da -da, the bouquet very positive card bring joy it talks about gifts and happiness and joy and you know all things pretty and everything next we have the psych this is another negative-ish card. Um, it cuts. So it depends on the context, um, how negative it is. But let's say if it's next to the birds, you know, that's harsh words. Um, that's words that hurts. Uh, this is a scythe and, and it hurts, it cuts. So it's another card that, that kind of, um, it has some sort of a, an element of danger in it. It has, um, you know, accident. Um, so it's, I would say it's, it's a negative. <sighs> negative card. Uh, I mean, it has instrument of, of pain in there. You know, that's a negative card. Um, unless you like pain. That's a personal thing then. But no, really, this is a, um, it's a nice, it's on the negative side. On, again, depending on the context, like if you're saying, if you're talking about, mm, am I done studying? And you get this, this is a no. You need to keep repeating. You need to, if you're saying, what, or if you say, what do I need to do, you know, about my exam or something about my studying? You have to keep doing it. You have to keep doing it. So um, it is a negative card. It is a no. But again, um, talks about repetition. It talks about you know, argument and fights and and that energy that you know debate energy. You know, it goes. It, it can be like you know, um, fighting. You know, with for something and 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 negative. Next, the birds. This is a neutral card. If you have um, this next to it. This is definitely somebody yelling, you know? Let's put this next to it. This is major verbal abuse. Abuse that, you know, really cuts. So this is a neutral. But if you have um, the bouquet, let's say next to it, where's the bouquet, Madame Bouquet? Then this is, um, you know, just, um, Oh my God, you look so good today. Um, good job. Good job today. You did wonderful. Or I'm so proud of you. Next we have the child. The child is a neutral. Again, because um, it depends on the cards around it. We can see what's going on. But this is a neutral. Next, I have the fox. Okay, this one we're gonna talk about. This is a negative card because it's a fox. And if you have a farm and you see a fox, not good, right? Uh, the fox steals, the fox manipulates, the fox lies, the fox deceives, the fox. Um, but again, this one is one of the ish, you know, ish, because it depends on the context. So let's say your context was about health. Uh, you need to look more. You need to go to a specialist. This is what the context was, um, an advice. Uh, what should I do? And this tells you to be smart, to be witty, to be street smart, to... Um, to look deeper, to to investigate, to find out. I am actually, unless you use, um, you're using a different um, deck is in my deck. I'm so happy that I actually freed the fox from the work um, meaning. 
um, so I don't use it for work anymore um, because I have the market so since I, I created my deck this is what I've been doing and actually I'm loving it and um, I'm loving it I'm loving that the, the fox now is free um, so the fox is a fox now it's a fox is a fox um, but if you still um, using so um, if you're using a, a deck that doesn't have a work card then this would be your, your work card um, but I kind of evolved and I like having my work card and um, so this is um, the fox and it's a uh, negative ish depending on the context again next one is the bear this is a neutral card because this depending on the cards around it can be negative or positive or neutral so um, again the context is very important um, but this is this is this is this is a neutral card so let's say you have um, the uh, negative card let's say the whip is next to it then it would be like a yelling mother you know depending on what context it is context so it could be either um, talking about diet um, your food your fridge restaurant or your financial um, bank account um, or just talking about strength and power um, or your boss yeah neutral the stars. This is a positive card. Yeah, it's one of my celestials. So this gives hope. So it's positive. New path. New adventure. New road. Hope. Three. Okay. The stork. The stork is positive ish. You know. The reason why I say ish is because um, the stork can be neutral in certain situations um, depending on the context again, but usually it is positive. It's more positive than neutral. Um, it comes more positive because it's always like about um, renovation. Uh, it talks about improvement. It talks about getting better. It talks about, you know, getting a raise. It talks about something, you know, like, you know, because the stork is always going to uh, a different new grass because the grass is always, you know, like not, not good enough here. So it's going to another one. Um, so the stork always look for the better, the better, the better. So it, it's on the positive side. It depends on the context again. So our next card is the dog. The dog is, this is a neutral card, um, it's a neutral card, it can be like, again, like if, if you have the snake next to it, you have a bad friend, um, if it's by itself, it's a positive-ish card, because it's a friend, so unless there's a negative card, but it's, it's neutral card, like for example, how do I say this? Why I'm saying it's neutral? Because if you're saying, if you're asking yes and no question and you get this, this is a neutral card. If you get the stork, also it's still a neutral. You need like a strong positive and a strong negative for your yes and no questions. Always remember that. So, um, you know, this can be, again, depending on the context, it could be, you know, talking about loyalty or it could be talking about your security system. So it depends on what, what you know, your question is. The tower another neutral card so again this is a neutral card again depending on the question and how you're asking the question you know let's say how is their marriage it's a neutral card but it's still it that kind of like it depends on the cards next to it but um the tower talks about uh institutions talks about any type of uh, big establishments uh, government legal stuff so I guess this goes on the neutral 
the garden is a neutral positive ish yeah so it's positive i would say it's a positive if you get um, a yes and no question and if you get this for yes and no question this is a yes it's a positive card um but it can really turn negative depending on i mean it can turn like it can um like if there's a the coffin and the uh, next to it you know it could be just you don't know if you know you know i mean but um it's a positive ish positive neutral ish more on the positive side all righty negative card I know, negative card. The one time this can be like um, a good thing is if you're saying, am I losing my job? No, you're not losing your job. So it's a negative, but it's a good thing. Get it? You're staying. We have the crossroad. The crossroads is neutral because it talks about multiples it talks about different choices it talks about your choice it talks about um you know the only way this i mean it depends on the context and what you're thinking i mean this is a neutral card but unless you're asking are these people are these two gonna stay together and you get this and this is separation um so i don't it depends on a separation is it a good thing or a bad thing but this talks about separation um so it's still a neutral this is a neutral Okay. Negative. The mice is a negative card. It eats away. It nags. It stress and worry and, and ugh, it just eats at you. It talks about deterioration and, and, and things going bad and, you know, expiring. So, negative. The heart. the heart the heart when you put a heart on something you know it's love so positive talks about your passion talks about you know generosity positive positive because it's a gift it's commitment it's you know again but it, it can be you know i mean um it's positive but positive depending on the context again you know it can be turned into something like a shackle or something um, with negative cards and stuff but it's um it's a positive card so if it's a yes and no question you get this it's yes neutral neutral card the, so this is your secrets or the work you're doing or the book you're reading or the book you're writing or your deck of cards so this is a neutral card neutral depending on what's around it again messages um it's a neutral card so depending on the cards around it so this talks about messages it talks about letters it talks about uh pictures it talks about lots of stuff so but it's all neutral because it, it's just talking about things and 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 and, and words and so it depends on what's around it let's see here we have the man card that's neutral another man card neutral woman card neutral another woman card neutral lily's neutral because this talks about um experience it talks about time something taking a long time it talks about your elderly um so neutral um you know it talks about also being wise and everything the sun the sun it's a very positive card this is a very 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 positive card this is one of my big positive card um so this is success victory yes you know i got i i didn't uh, look at me look at me look at me wow you know i mean positive positive this is another positive card this is part of my celestial those, those this one and sun moon and the stars are the celestial cards and all celestial cards are positive um this one is positive too it's not as strong as the sun so if you get this year moon you know it's a positive card it's a good thing it's a good thing again context remember but this is a positive card this is this is a very 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 positive card very very strong positive card you know because it's like aha, i 
figured it out and be like, ah, oh, so this is a, uh, you know, this is, this is, this is, I found the key, you know, this is the, I found how to do this. It's still the same as I figured it out. <laughs> so basically this, this is your key card. Like when you have the key, you have the key to everything, you know, right? So the key is very important, very, very positive. It's a very positive card. Okay. And also it shows what's important. Like, hey, pay attention, pay attention to this card, pay attention to that card. So key, very important card, very positive. Me like it. Again, it's a positive-ish card. I mean, um, when it talks about abundance, it's positive. But when it talks about a lot, so it's neutral. So it's kind of like neutral, positive, neutral, positive, ish, ish, neutral, ish, positive, ish. So because if it's a lot of, and then you have next to it um, fish, and then there's the coffin. So that's a lot of depressing stuff. Or the fish next to um, uh, the, 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 the whip. That's a lot of argument so again um i mean with these cards everything can you know can can be positive and you know having this duality this is another another um video but um these cards can be like for example even the coffin maybe sometimes the coffin is a good thing so but here just we're just talking about yes and no and what's you know positive and negative yes positive again it can be negative if it's you know next to a negative card it just pulls it down and makes it like heavy weight get any yes and no the anchor is a yes so positive big negative big negative big negative this is a torture machine this is a uh, uh, this is they used to use this to torture people put people on the cross this is talks about your grief your pain your suffering your crying this is uh, you know negative card i mean it can come in a context that is a neutral but very very rarely when it's talking about religion but this is very rarely um very rarely i've i've rarely see it oh, it's mostly negative Yes, like 99.9. .9. Negative. Negative. No. Then we get into the um, my extra card. This is a neutral card because this one talks about um, the spirit world. It talks about the destiny. It talks about it talks about your destiny. It talks about things that has to happen when this ha comes up, you know, and a, and a, and a, you know, uh, is this going to happen? And you get this, oh, yeah, it's happening because this is like from above, stuff from above that is definite. Um, talks about your spirituality, talks about um, um, everything around you. So this is a spirit card, is neutral. So it depends on what's around it. We can, you know, it tells us um, more about it. So this is a neutral card. Um, then we have the incense burner. This is another neutral card. Um, this clarifies, this clears, this is, makes things like, what is it, incense burner? What, what is it? When you put it in incense, you feel good. It, it's, um, <sighs> but if it's, there's negative cards next to it, um, it tells you that, you know, there's stuff in the air that is not good. So it's a neutral card. Um, going on the positive-ish because it does purifies and clarifies and, and clear and, 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 and take things away, you know, clean things away. Um, this is like, this is like having your sage card. This is like I have a sage here. You know what I mean? Um, so it's neutral, positive-ish, positive, neutral kind of thing. Then I have the uh, bed. This is a positive card because it talks about comfort. So if you have a question, yes and no, um, this is a yes. This one, if you have a question, question yes and no, you, you need a, you need a positive card, okay? Um, again with this one, but this is a yes because um, let's say you know did I get this? If it's a yes and no question, again it's a yes. If you know, it's, um, how is this relationship? It's comfortable. Um, am I gonna enjoy my job? Yes. Um, 
is he uh, a good guy a good guy or is she a, a good woman she's comfortable she's yes so yes so it's a yes yes Yes, you know, it's, it's a very, it talks about comfort, it talks about uh, relaxation, it talks about your sleep, it talks about just generally being at ease and, and, and being, you know, just, you know, you know. This is a neutral, the market, because it talks about work, so it's neutral. So depending on what's around it, we can tell more. And this conclude. So I hope you have a... Um, better understanding about the cards and um how some stuff sometimes they're neutral sometimes they're positive sometimes they're negative and how they come um let me know what you think if you have any question right below and i will do my best to answer it if you want different type of videos let me know and again i will do when i can what i can when i can love you subscribe and share